All aboard! Welcome to the Storytime Train. Please subscribe to enjoy more books read aloud. Watch the Cookie! Written and illustrated by Nancy Cote. Sam and Mousy were best friends. When Sam reads books, Mousy read too. When Sam took a bath, Mousy did too. When Sam went to sleep, Mousy slept close, so close that Sam couldn't barely move. One morning, the wind was blowing hard. Let's go to the park. Fly my kite, said Sam. I'll wait at home, said Mousy, who had never flown a kite. Please, begged Sam. Mousy couldn't say no. Hold on tight, Sam called as the kite went up and up. Mousy held on tight. I know you could do it," said Sam, when they sat down to rest. Sam reached, reached into the pocket. Surprise! He shouted. It was a great big chocolate chip cookie wrapped in a red paper napkin. Mousy jumped up and down, but then Sam began to wiggle. He crossed his legs. He stood. He rocked back and forth. Sam couldn't wait. He had to go, and he had to go now. Watch the cookie. I'll be right back. He told Mousy. Mousy gulped. He wasn't the only one watching the cookie. Two pigeons flew down and began to peck. At the crispy brown edge, Mousy jumped up and down. The pigeon pecked. Mousy ran in circles, but the pigeons kept pecking. Mousy spotted the napkin. He had a super idea. Stop that! Sam's cookie, Mousy said with determination. The pigeons flew away, knocking the cookie to the ground. An army of ants picked up the cookie and marched. Mousy stomped his feet. The ants marched. Mousy waved his arms, but. The ants kept marching. Mousy cleared his throat. He leaped to the ground. Stop! That Sam's cookie! He demanded. The ants dropped the cookie. The cookie rolled down the hill, around the pond, under a stroller, over a shoe, through the can. Crash against the trash bin. I smell something good to eat," said a voice. Mousy looked up. A hungry cat was peering down at him. Mousy grabbed the cookie. He held it tight. That Sam cookie," he squeaked. Silly mouse! Cats don't eat cookies. Cats eat mice. Mousy wasn't strong like a cat. He wasn't as big as a cat, but he had something the cat didn't have. The cat opened his mouth wide. With super strength, Mousy hurled the cookie. Into the cat's mouth. That Sam's cookie! He roared. The cat dropped Mousy and ran away. Sam saw the whole thing. You are very brave, he told Mousy. I guess I am, 
said the little mouse. Let's go home and make another cookie, said Sam. No, let's have a peanut butter sandwich instead, said Mousy. Whatever you like, answered Sam. That night, when Mousy read a book, Sam reads too. When the Mousy took a shower, Sam did too. And when Mousy went to bed, Sam slept close, so close that Mousy couldn't barely move. That's just what best friends do. The end. Thanks for riding the Storytime train. Please subscribe for more reading adventures.